everyone welcome back to my channel my name is jade if you're new here a very warm welcome and if you're one of my lovely subscribers always come back thank you so much for coming back i look pale i mean i am in front of a window so it's not doing me any justice but I'm trying to go like makeup free to try and clean up my skin a bit so this vlog will feature me like this but um yeah i no, hope you're all well i thought i would vlog today i don't know why it is sunday it's a sunday yep still sunday um and I basically just need to do like the normal stuff like the house is a mess like if you see my kitchen just needs a good tidy up um just everywhere basically like the little breakfast bar's a mess the hallway like do you know what I mean you know when just everywhere is just not the one I don't even want to take you upstairs it's just so I just thought should I do a vlog because i know people like tend to i mean i'm not doing oh my god you haven't even seen this bit do you want to see the good bit like the really 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 good bit and don't ask me how it got like this well i can tell you how it got like this but just don't judge me like look at my top of my landing like so you know when you've got to do stuff basically what happened here it was an organized mess and then i had to find something so i just rummaged through it rummaged through my cupboard rummaged through everything there and i just basically tipped it upside down look at my clothes to be put away like jade are you having a laugh so i thought right what can make this a little bit more okay to do and i figured if i maybe turn it into a vlog it might motivate me to do it so let's see what logie's doing hey logs you okay yeah in here slightly a mess again as well good times basically the whole house so today i need to tidy up everywhere i'm gonna see how much i can get done it's now 10 30 i've just dropped the girls off to like a little theater class um i've got to pick blake up at 11 blair up at one i need to take my mum food shopping and myself food shopping anyway because we need food shopping um and do all of this so who thinks i can do it i don't know how to do the vlogs i don't know whether to just obviously not gonna watch me minute for minute because that would be long but um i'll probably just like you know as i'm doing the rooms speed through them and yeah that's it like let's i'm going to start with the kitchen i think because it's like essential basically i have to just quickly address my skin because it's something oh rough snuggling up to me ralphie hi ralphie um because it's something that just drives me mad it's like progressively got worse over the last couple of months it's not even a couple of months, it's got to be a year because I remember vlogging for my 30th and that, like, it was a couple of weeks before then that I started, have, like, having severe breakouts and, like, they was even worse than this, imagine. Um, I might even put a picture in there, I might not, I don't know. Um, but it's just progressively got worse and it's driving me mad. Like, it's so, like, your skin is such a big factor and it's just so annoying so anyway i think i mentioned in a vlog i was vlogging yesterday and i mentioned there that i'm waiting for some like magical creams that my friend courtney recommended ralph what are you doing babes he's looking around like like there's someone here with us he's like looking around like he's looking at someone um anyway yeah so i'm waiting for like this miracle cream and um basically it's supposed to be really good really really super good for skin and like really clear it up so that is like one of my last hopes before i have to basically take out a mini loan because i went to a skin place and the price they were saying for like skin stuff was all i think it was about six i don't even know the word of it now but it was six something and the offer price get this was about 786 pound sorry like my makeup is far less than that i'll just wear makeup is fine um so yeah look how cute ralph is do you love me ralph but um yeah so i just wanted to address that i know it's super bad and trust me this is a humongous step for me to even put a camera in my face like this like i don't know what i'm playing at <laughs> don't know what i'm playing at and yeah lou's gonna be like jade what are you doing but hey ho beauty is not skin deep does that, does that make sense i don't know anyway i'm gonna go and tidy up because this is what i do queen of procrastination i'm sitting on my bed like a lady of leisure when i just showed you what the house is looking like Let's go.
speed clean ever. It's now 20 past 11. I am going to have quickly just sort of neatened up the kitchen. So it's not like a deep clean, but you know, it's a livable clean. And we'll we take that. Um, I've got some chicken that I'm quickly defrosting because in and amongst my day planning, I forgot that I had to like cook dinner. So I am going to quickly go and run and get low, Logie. Run and get Blakey now and then come back, probably prep the dinner and then maybe start on the clothes. Fun times. So I'm gonna chuck dinner on quickly. Just got back with Blakey. I'm gonna use one of these in the slow cooker. I've never used them before, but I've asked a few people and they said that they're okay. So I'm gonna try that out for like a quick convenient dinner. I've got some chicken, just some seasoning, black pepper, thyme, salt, almost finished. I didn't realize that. Garlic, rosemary, onions, carrots. It says that. It doesn't say that's all you need, but that's what I'm going to put in. I'm going to just chuck it into the slow cooker. I'm going to brown that off, chuck it into the slow cooker, and then hope for the best. So that is it in. Six hours on high. Not going to lie. I've seen more appetizing things, but we'll wait this one out and hopefully it turns out okay. So it's 10 to 5 now, and I've literally just got back in from food shopping. Um, I took my... Let me go out here quickly because the girls are talking. I took my mum food shopping quickly. I am not going food shopping again on a Sunday. I normally like to go, um, like, in the mornings, but then, like, my work hours have changed, so I can't really do the mornings anymore. But I tell you what, definitely not going on a Sunday again. Like, it's like the shops are almost finished. <laughs> it's like they're empty, and then, like, I ended in farm foods, and... They was rushing us out there because they closed at five. No, they didn't, they closed at four. Um, but yeah, I was just trying to tally up because I really want to try and like budget for food shopping because I never do. I literally just shop, buy loads of snacks and crap that you don't need. But I'm gonna really try and like start budgeting the food shop. So I was just trying to tally up now. I didn't go out with a budget, but I just thought, and I still need to go Tesco tomorrow. So I still need to get like my chicken legs, chicken breast, minced meat, some f and fruit and veg maybe some juice and dog food so i still need to spend about 50 pound tomorrow and that'll just last the week um and then i spent 70 pounds today and then i've probably got about 10 pound worth of stuff in the house anyway like like little snacks for lunchbox stuff and stuff like that that i didn't need to buy so what is that 50 60 plus seven so 130 pounds for the week and then some things i got today will obviously last a bit longer than the week so it's not I don't know I'm thinking probably I like maybe I should try and get it down to about 120 a week I think that's okay is it okay I don't know for like a family of six what do we think I'll show you what I got anyway so I went to Asda and farm foods um what did I get let me turn the camera around sorry the girls are here and they're making this noise right so I got some girls for one minute I got some frozen bits um because obviously these are good for like if I'm doing a meal and the kids don't eat it then we just chuck them something in the oven or like if it's a weekend and they have some lunch and then they'll have cooked dinner later so this in farm foods is like free for 10 pounds so you get nuggets more nuggets and fish fingers 10 pound this is two pounds you get two packs of these big family sized chips for five pounds these are one pound each girls these are one pound each, 89p in farm foods. I picked up three of these, but I gave my mum them. I'm trying to, I'm trying to eat a bit better this week, so I'm trying to get some like snacky stuff. So I picked these noodles up in Asda. Are they noodles? They're like soup, ramen noodles type thing. They were three for a pound, so hopefully they're okay. They are 90 calories per one, so yeah, that should be okay. I picked up some balsamic vinegar for salad, some dolmeo sauce that was 150. Louis eats corned beef, so I get two tins of those. That's like 230 each. Some squares bars, 199. One kg of pasta, that's like 69p. This is all farm foods, by the way. I picked this up to try and asda. It's some honey chili sauce. So I thought that'd be nice. Like this was only a pound. I got it to go with some spare ribs for Lou for a meal in the week. Like I said, the rest of the meat for the rest of the week I will get tomorrow. Um, some ham for packed lunches, pack of Brussels sprouts, some seasoning, so some all-purpose and barbecue seasoning. Um, these were like, I don't know, 69 pence, 85 pence, three pounds, four pound 80. Um, two packs of clubs, one pound each, because like I said, I'm gonna try and do a bit better this week with eating. So I'm trying to get like, you know, the ones that you know are not too bad. Um, so that's all I got in farm foods. No, actually, I didn't. I got more. So these are two pounds thirty nine in farm foods for six. You get twelve tins for eight pound fifty of tuna. So again, that will be for like a meal in the week, but that will last obviously longer than a week. Um, three packs of like these mini spaghetti tins. These are three. If you buy girls, girls. Shh. If you buy three packs of these, you get them for a pound each, and then one pound fifty for three sweet corns. 
bag of rice because we literally go through rice like there's no tomorrow. So this 5 kg sack is 4 99 If anyone knows where to get Dove deodorant for cheaper, then tell me. Because this is £1.70. I'd be grudge paying it. But then I really like Dove deodorant, so I need that. Baby wipes, 58 pence in Asda. And then Farm Foods also do 18 toilet rolls. This has gone up. So this used to be 3 99 It's now £4.50. Um, but that is everything. So that will pretty much do us for like over... I'd say over a week because obviously like who's gonna go through two big bags of chips and all that that will do us for like longer than a week and the frozen food and stuff um i just need to get the fresh bits tomorrow for like actual dinners like the chicken and the mince and stuff like that um but yeah all in all about 130 pounds between three shops what shops would it be tesco farm foods and asda i don't know it's just getting so expensive with inflation like honestly i go to pick things up in the shop and i'm just like why have they put it up so much but I don't know how much I'd like to know like I'd be interested to know like sort of what family size you cater for and how much your budgets are per week because if I can get it cheaper then I should do you think 130 for a family of six is a lot I don't know let me know anyway but um yeah so it's now five o'clock pretty much and I haven't done nothing like I thought I was gonna do. all I've basically done today is do the kitchen obviously I took the kids to wherever walked the dog done the dinner but took my mum shopping and myself shopping but I didn't do any of the cleaning that I wanted to do I'm definitely going to get the clothes put away um I can probably neaten up in this sitting room like that's not a big job at all basically I'm not going to do the kids room or the landing upstairs where it's just a mess but I'll do that tomorrow or something after work it's not a big deal not a big deal Jay but yeah I'm going to get the clothes done and then I don't know maybe eat and no oh, I've got to clean out the fridge now what am I on about I've got to pack the shopping away you've got to make space So now that I've actually cleaned out the fridge, it looks super duper empty, but obviously I need to get most of the fresh stuff tomorrow in Tesco. So like I need eggs, meat and stuff, but I don't know, do you like looking inside people's fridges and freezers? I've just got like ham, hot dogs, and that will be like for some sort of something in the week. Ham for packed lunches. These are our cheese and butters and all that's kept. We normally have like juices here, but I need to get some more juice in the shop. Um, this is some rice that Lou will have with dinner tonight. In here I keep for the kids like, yogurts jelly stuff like that for packed lunches this will be fruit and veg in there this is a meat drop obviously i need to go tomorrow again um in the doors a bit of a mess to be honest like here's where we normally have eggs and stuff like that um and like ciders and that but obviously i need to go do more shopping mayos and that stuff and then in the freezer i'm only doing this because i see this in other people i know that people like to see people's fridges and freezers this top drawer is where we keep like all the bits of frozen meat and stuff like that just bags and bags of it over here some Yorkshire puddings um but yeah that's just like all frozen meat in there this side is like our naughty's processed food drawer where it's just got all the nuggets fish fingers all that jazz and then we have like a ice cream ice lolly drawer and that's it so i can finish off tomorrow the shopping and hopefully that will look a bit more healthy mm. i'm just taking in this moment of cuddling yeah. because one minute baba so i'm just taking in this moment of cuddling because apparently blake missed me so she was crying and i was just explaining to them how sad it is that they're not going to be my babies forever so i can't just cuddle them like this forever because one day very soon they're going to be bigger than me blair i hope that your leg wasn't just showing there. i've just said you sit still because you're on the camera darling whoop it's just a leg guys she's got clothes on um so yeah i'm just like you know vlogging the moment so that we can look back on it when you're like all big and big basically what's the time now oh 10 past seven time to go to bed i've still got all my clothes to get put away oh my god please tell me how i have procrastinated folding all these clothes until five to eight in the evening man i've got so much oh my god <laughs> i want to cry right crack on with this jade and then i was going to paint my nails after but i mm, don't think so man better get on with it
idea why I was even moaning. Like that was, it only took me 25 minutes to um, put them all away. So that wasn't bad at all. I am quickly ironing all the kids' uniforms for the week. Um, I hate ironing, but I usually use this time to like watch some YouTube videos, something like that. If you saw Ralphie jumping on the clothes, it's like super windy and rainy and he uses these drawers as access to the window. Um, so yeah, he was like basically being neighborhood watch. I don't normally have my blinds open either, but they're such a horrific color that I couldn't bear to put them on the video. <laughs> So um, that's why they was open and I was letting myself be on site to all the neighbours. But yeah, I'm just going to quickly iron this. Being this is only half eight now, it's not even that bad. I think I probably will just try and do my nails. Um, I basically bought myself a little um, home mini shellac kit. It was only like £21 on Amazon. Um, I'll leave a link if anyone's interested. I'll show you it in a minute. You okay, Ralph? Hi. No, I'm ironing. You have to get down, mate. Um, yeah, I'll leave a link just to show you. No, sorry. I mean, I'll show you in a second, just in case anyone's interested. I think it came with about like ten different colours: the little UV lamp, the things that you basically need for it for like about twenty-one pounds. So, weren't that bad. So, I'm going to treat myself to that because I hate Ralphie. Please, I've ironed these stuff. Um, I hate when you do your nails and literally the next day they're chipping. But then at the same time, I don't want the cost of um, doing my nails every month because I just can't right now. It's just like. I don't know like sometimes it doesn't when it comes to the kids you don't mind spending money when it comes to yourself you're like oh no I better not spend that so um yeah right now I'm just trying to like do some thrifty living so does that even make sense also does anybody else have a cordless iron don't worry about that burn bit I'm gonna scrub it off later not later actually that's a lie I'm gonna scrub it off at some point soon um these this is the most pointless thing I've ever bought ever like I don't understand what possessed me to buy it um but it's stupid like between everything you've got to keep putting it down to charge so annoying um but yeah so i will probably wrap the vlog up there i thought i was talking for seven minutes i was about to say what um yeah so i'll be showing you the little nail kit just in case anybody's interested and then i will wrap the vlog up there because you spent the day with me and again don't want to bore you just by doing like long pointless vlogs but then at the same time i enjoy doing long pointless vlogs vlogs so hey ho but yeah i'm gonna watch some youtube videos now while ironing and then do my nails and that will be it also for space saving these are great like i just use this little fold out iron board and i pop it on top of my drawers and i am being as i don't have the space for a big one so this is how the little schlack kit comes just in this little bag and this is what you get inside of it. So you've got your little nail cleaner, some files, um, some separators. This is a cuticle revitalizer oil. You've got a little dust brush, um, some nail clippers, cuticle cutter, um, cuticle pusher. This is some little swatch patches. So I believe you put your colors on them and then you sort of smudge it onto the top so you know the tone of each color. I'll try and set a little insert just to show you the colours that it comes with but these are your colours so it's actually six colours and then your top coat base coat and then your little UV lamp now I'm not gonna lie <laughs> that is majorly smaller than what I expected but I mean I'm sure it's about 21 pounds what can you expect prime and that's including like next day delivery so my hand fits under it will do the job and that guys is where I am going to end this vlog today I've just heard Lou coming downstairs so I'm gonna probably head down have some dinner with him and see how his day was um i hope you enjoyed the vlog i mean i know it was a super basic watch me tidy up my house and see what food i got but if you do enjoy that type of stuff then do please give it a big thumbs up as always i appreciate your support thank you so much for watching if you have any video ideas like content ideas or whatever not that you want me to do then let me know in the description but no not the description box let me know in the comments let me know in the comments down below and i'll be sure to do them um and until the next video guys take care and i will see you then Bye. I forgot to show you all how the chicken for the slow cooker came out, but this is it. Ready for Lou. He don't eat a lot, does he?